Hey guys, this is the Nightly Toker, and this is because I puff. This is a brand new episode. This is, I think, the fourth episode of this um, podcast series here. I'm super stoked. You just heard the new kind of intro. I was kind of tweaking it a little bit. I haven't really had time to do one up till now. Uh, it's pretty short, whereas over on the po- uh, the, the, the Puffcast, that intro was fairly long. i got to dial that one back a little bit. This one's pretty short. It's only about 18 seconds. Hope you guys like it. It's pretty basic, but you know what? It just and you know welcomes the podcast, welcomes you guys in. And uh, yeah, tonight on this episode, we are exploring TNB Naturals. Uh, these guys are based out of Vernon, B.C., not too far from the Puffcast location, which is super cool. And uh, yeah, we uh, talked a little bit with the owners of this company because they actually reached out to us. So you know what? And when I say us, I mean me, you know, me. But <laughs> all right. Um, and no, I haven't really had, I have been dabbing off and on throughout the day when the moment allows it. Um, right now, I'm not really very high at all, but because uh, I haven't puffed in uh, mm, eh, probably about three, four, four hours maybe. I don't know. I puffed around dinner time when I was barbecuing. But yeah, so we are going to do some dabs, some little mini dabs off the Atmos pen, and uh, we're going to explore TNB natu- tnbnaturals.com and uh, go over just a little bit what I talked about with the owners uh, the other day, but first we're going to take a hit. It helps to turn on the pen, though, because without it, there's no power. <sighs> Clear those lungs, because it's going to hurt. I know it. We're going to go big on this one. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <coughs> <coughs> <clears throat> Whew. Waza. Oh. All right, we're good. Okay. So, first off, TNB Naturals. You're probably wondering, okay, who are they? What are they? What do they do? Now, I went into a little bit of detail about them over on the Puffcast on an episode on Tuesday, this last Tuesday. And I, I briefly talked about them again last night on episode 42 of the Puffcast. But yeah, if you don't know who they are, you're missing out. These guys, you know what? They they just have awesome, awesome stuff. They are part of the um, the growers community, I guess you can say. Uh, they make some stellar products that help you grow better, more powerful, potent yields from your um, your plants, right? And of course, I'm talking about cannabis plants. Uh, I'm sure you could use it for other plants. But I think it would pay off better if you use it on your seedlings that you're trying to get juicy and fat and nug-like and happy. But yeah, they make some pretty awesome products. They're really about, uh, it really seems like they have a more sensible, organic approach to enriching uh, the plant life, right? Which is really cool. They're all about CO2, actually, which, you know what, until I had come across their website after they reached out to me i had no idea like why would you put co2 in a plant however these guys they know what they're doing so i'm just gonna go over some of their products and uh yeah you know what i encourage you as i'm talking about this type it up type them out tmbnaturals.com check out the site and check out the reviews i've been checking out reviews all afternoon uh and then different videos that people have been posting on YouTube, there's several different uh, distributors that carry this product. You can find their products on their website, on Amazon, on uh, distributors, distributors, <laughs> distributors. There we go, all around the world, I believe. But uh, like one of the products is called the Enricher. Now it's uh, a natural plant booster. So I, th- I think you would kind of think of this as kind of like Miracle Grow. However, it's huh, way fucking better. So. The Enricher is, a per- is, per- is perfect for all types of plants at all stages of growth. From the first day of vegetation to the last two weeks of flowering, it promotes better yields, greener plants, faster germination, more blooms, stronger plants, and bigger roots. Roots, I think, play a huge part because if you have 
a big plant and you have very weak roots, you know what? I think it's not going to produce as well. If you can have very solid roots, I think this goes for all vegetation, all plants. You want a good root system. It is vital. So the fact that these definitely help promote and encourage those roots to get super strong, super thick, super healthy, that's awesome. It goes on to say, the unique blend of magnesium and citric acid dissolves instantly when added to water and aids in the activation of numerous plant enzymes required in the growth process. Hmm, that's cool. It also assists in the breakup of insoluble oxidized micronutrients and makes them available for uptake, which means it breaks everything down so that the plant can absorb it better. Right? Is that, you know, that's how I'm taking it. Uh, conditioning the soil at the same time, which, you know what? Pretty good. The enricher increases essential oils and resin production, ooh, while reducing the risk of blossom rot and improving overall flavor. Oh, that's cool. So you can get some pretty sweet, and I don't mean sweet literally, but really good flavor out of your plants, out of your flower, using this stuff. So that's kind of cool. Like I mentioned, when I talked about him before, my brother-in-law actually does grow his own. So, um, yeah, I'm definitely going to turn him on to these guys because I'd like to see how it works. Right? One of the other really top-notch products is called the Enhancer. And this is where that CO2 thing comes in now. If you're not familiar with CO2, bear with me because I don't know a whole lot about CO2 either. But we're going to read this out and uh, hopefully we can both learn a little bit of something. All right, the enhancer is made from all natural, 100% organic ingredients. That's vital. A lot of you guys out there who are growing organically, you know, at first I was like, you know what, there's no difference. There's no difference in weed from organic or not organic. It's just, it's weed. I've had organic weed. There is a difference. There really is. Flavor, potency, smell definitely changes. Not drastically in most cases, but... um. I find uh, taste and potency, there's definitely a significant, um, noticeable, very noticeable difference. Um, So yeah, 100% organic ingredients, which when activated, create a blast of CO2 that can reach 1,200 parts per million in a 12 by 12 by 12 area. That's a pretty freaking big area. So I think, you know, I'm guessing you just need one of these canisters to do that large of a space. That's pretty good. Uh, activate the enhancer by simply adding one liter of warm water. So you add a bit of water, then you place on the lid, you remove the sticker on the top, and then you cover the small hole, and you shake the fuck out of it. That's where I would be just be like, hey, because my ADHD would just be like, let's just shake it, shake it, shake it. It's as simple as that. The enhancer works off the natural phenom known as, let's see if I can say this without slurring it and fucking it up, photosynthesis. You know what? That was flawless. Say it ten times, ten times fast, so. So, known as photosynthesis, and will begin to disperse CO2 within the hour. That's kind of cool. Giving the enhancer a quick shake every day or two is all that is all that this miraculous product requires. So, every couple days, pull it out, put it back in, and it keeps moving that stuff. And I, I think the CO2 just helps deliver that oxygen, that the, you know, the plant nutrients. It just disperses it. Are better. It's a better delivery method. That's that's kind of what I'm getting from this, which is pretty cool. Uh, keep the first canister in your garden for an additional two weeks, as it's still producing CO2. So these things last about two to three weeks. After that, pull it, put in a new one, or you can buy the TNB CO2 refill pack, which is I'm guessing a lot cheaper than buying a whole new canister. Uh, you refill it up, do your you process, shake and bake, put it back in, you're good to go. So you know what? That is kind of cool. That is kind of cool. Those are their, it looks like there are three main products. Uh, the Enhancer, which is your canister CO2 delivery system. That's $39.99. It's not bad. It's not bad. Um, CO2 refill pack, $24.99. So I, I can definitely see why this would be a good option. You spend 40 bucks originally, you get your canister, pop that in two to three weeks. It's going gonna, it's gonna to die out. The, the maximum potency is going to be very low on that, I would assume. So then you're going to jump over if you want, get a CO2 refill pack for 25 bucks, refill it, put your canister back in, you're good to go. Simple as that. They've also got, got their very own branded and essentially uh, well-designed CO2 monitor specifically for their type of products, right? So you know exactly how much it's working, which again is pretty freaking cool. 
Um, <coughs> sorry, I tried to take a dab at the same time. It didn't work. They also have a really cool product. Uh, we'll get to that in a few minutes here. They've got specially designed trimmers. Uh, just has some side stuff. They've got some med tanners, some dube tubes, which look super freaking slick, by the way. They look like these little pods, like steel pods, like you can just hang off your keychain. I think that would be so slick. Stick a nice little joint in there. Um, take it with you. Nobody's going to know what it is. Crack it open. I'm, I'm guessing it's airtight, of course. You're good to go. So, the other day, when I was talking with these guys, and uh, I asked them a few questions. And they were more than obliged to answer. So, we're going to get into the questions here. So, of course, now i got to scroll up, because there's one question, and another question, and another question. Alright, so I asked them, when did you launch... Um, so they said, uh, officially launched Team B Naturals, Inc. They're incorporated. That's pretty cool. Back in 2012. So they're relatively new. They've been around, well, they've been around for five years. You know what? I would say they're pretty well established because they, they do seem to be very global. They're definitely on the market everywhere you can go. They can only get bigger from here, which is very cool. But yeah, five years, pretty good run. They're only going to get bigger. Um... Sorry, these questions are all over the place. Uh, yeah. Um, so they want to say, we know our flagship product, the Enhancer, was going to revolutionize the hydroponics industry right from the get-go and change the way people thought about supplemental CO2. It's pretty cool. So they knew, they, you could tell, they, they really do care about the product that they have, that they deliver, because it's manufactured in Canada. Right in Vernon, which is pretty freaking cool. Because most things are outsourced these days by another company, by somebody else, by another country, whoever, whoever, wherever. They do everything in house, which I have to respect because that is just amazing. I love BC businesses. I love Canada businesses, or Canadian, uh, to see businesses in BC and pretty much my next door neighbors, more or less. Pretty cool. Uh, TNB, TNB, because I asked him, what does the name stand for? TNB stands for There's Nothing Better. Oh, okay. And uh, that's been foundation for our entire product line and something we strive towards with every new product we bring to the market. It's pretty cool. They clearly want to put out the best product they can, right? That's, you got to respect that. you got to respect that. Um, I asked them, do you have any new products that are you're hoping to develop or bring to the market soon here? And he said, we just recently launched a new all-natural pH up and down. So, of course, your pH balances. With this product, you can adjust up or down, which is pretty cool. Um, up and down that people are really excited about. And prior to that, we brought out a CO2 monitor of our own an all-natural plant booster and corrective supplement called the Enricher. That's one of the ones that we talked about earlier, which, you know what, that's pretty cool. We currently have a few new products in research and development stage, so we encourage growers to stay connected with us through our various social media sites or via their website, Team B Naturals. Now, of course, they reached out to me on Twitter, so, of course, you can find them on Twitter at TMB Natural. Uh, I'm not sure if they are on Instagram. Let's take a quick peek. I'm sure I could find that. Um, where are you? Yes, so you know what? They are on Instagram, TNB underscore naturals. And of course, you can also find them on Facebook. Uh, just look for TNB naturals. You can find their page there as well. Which, you know what? They're, they're definitely around. Moving on to more of what we talked about. I had to scroll past the page, and I unfortunately scrolled way the hell up, so now i got to scroll back down. Sorry, guys, bear with me. So while I'm doing this and readjusting my headset for, like, the one million, millionth time, we're going to take a dab. Heat this sucker up. Here we go. Mmm. Mmm. Love that chirpiness. All right. So, yeah, so find them on their websites. Moving back down the list, uh, people should choose TMB Naturals if they're looking for safe, simple, and effective ways to naturally improve plant health and final yield. That's pretty cool. 
So really, the whole idea, the whole concept behind their company, behind their product lines, is to give you the best plant yield possible. The fact that it really helps with that flavor is super cool. Because I don't know if you're about, you're like me, but you've probably had a little bit of weed where the flavor is lacking. I've had some super potent weed where the flavor just, it wasn't very good. I've had other strains where, again, flavor was not very good and very lacking in the potency. You never know. So, you know, I, I don't want to say that flavor really reflects potency, but when you can enjoy that taste, when you, it doesn't matter how you, how you smoke it or vape it, right, or combust it, whatever, however way you do it, but you want something with good flavor. So, you know, it's cool. Definitely got to check out the stuff. And, of course, one of the main questions which I ask everybody when, because uh, I've, I've featured a few websites now, anybody I talk with, I always ask them, one of the same questions at the end. And that question would be, and of course this is the biggest, most important one, the best munchies after a good sesh. You know what these guys came up with? And I have to agree. Now, of course, I can't have this because I'm diabetic. But back before I was diabetic, way back, way back, this just sounds, this would have been perfect. I didn't smoke back then. <laughs> but it, is, it was still a perfect snack. Uh, they say, following the sesh, we're usually reaching for a slice of strawberry cheesecake and some chocolate milk. You know what? The moment they told me that, I was like, hmm, started thinking about it. And damn, I started to get the munchies. Like, no shit. That would be, oop, there goes my chair. That would be a perfect snack when you got the munchies. Strawberry cheesecake? Come on. A nice tall glass of ice cold chocolate milk. Mm -mm. Of course, now, I don't know about other areas, but in BC, of course, we have uh, Dairyland, we have Island Farms, Blackwell. Blackwell chocolate milk and Island Farm chocolate milk is so rich and creamy and delicious. It just is. It just is. So, uh, I just wish they made that in more of a sugar-free option. Or very, very low sugar, but it's not. But yeah, so definitely check these guys out because they got some cool products, especially if you're a grower. If you just want to see what they do, go check them out, tmbnaturals.com. If you're a grower and you're looking for better ways to enhance your yields and really show your plant who's boss, give that plant the tools to be better. That's what you want to give it. You want to get the enricher. Uh, you want to get uh, blah, 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 the enhancer. You got your TNB pH up and down. You know what? If you know what you're doing, definitely use the right products. Check these guys out. I think they will uh, prove how good they are in the results when uh, you use them. So, yeah. But, yeah, these guys, check it out. They ha they're, they're distributed through a lot of different companies here. Not going to start naming them all off, but uh, you know what? They're, these guys are definitely around, which is cool. Which is cool. I was actually really floored when they said that... Uh, they were in Vernon. Because it's like, no shit! That's cool. And I stand by it. I think one day, I'll have to go check it out. I'll have to go down there and uh, maybe take a little tour of their facility if they would let me. I think that would be pretty cool. And uh, maybe have a sesh. Maybe, uh, not necessarily in the facility, of course. But have a sesh with these guys. And uh, maybe from a yield of something grown with those products. That would be pretty cool. That would be pretty cool. <sighs> Check it out in the action. Ooh, they got lots of videos and links to cool stuff of different people using the products. Yeah. I'd play it. I'd click on it. However, my computer is a little uh, not clickety, clickety, and I don't have Adobe Flash Player, apparently. Like, really? Hmm. Well, that's different. Oh, apparently I did. I just had to click the button. That's cool. So, Team B Naturals for all your plant needs. Just do it. Just do it. Just let it grow. Just let it grow. Uh, I've never seen CO2 used for a plant. But, oh, excuse me. I think it would be pretty cool. I don't know how long it takes from when you're getting seedlings up to, you know, full yield when you're growing. I don't know anything about growing. I would love to one day be able to grow some uh, in an area that's better fitted for it. <laughs> Not my yard. <laughs> But watching, oh my god, okay, so I'm watching this time-lapse video on their site of 
a pl- of yield, a plant basically going with nothing, and then one with their stuff. And it's it's definitely um, bigger. Definitely bigger. And this is just a seedling, but it deletes on these things. Root length, I mean, holy crap, a 339% increase on root length. length. That's significant. That is the difference. That's the foundation of your plant. Your root system is really what gives you the entire plant life. So, 21 day time lapse. The one on the left, of course, doesn't have a, any CO2 product, or TMP products in it. The one on the right on the video is just freaking insanely bigger. That's really cool. Hmm. Holy crap. That's pretty neat. And this is using, of course, a, a CO2 monitor from them to track how much CO2 is getting into your plant. Normally, you're getting very low CO2. Um, ah. I was about to say carbonation. <laughs> I don't know. How does it, you know, CO2 into it? I don't know. I don't know shit. But by most, I don't even want to pronounce that because I'm going to say it wrong. But yeah, you know what? Check this video out on their site. It's on their homepage, teambnaturals.com slash home dot HTML or just click on the link and you will find it right in there, which is cool. Just check it down to where it says check out, check it out in action. Got to see it to believe you guys. It's very cool. And if you want better, maybe more uh, biased reviews, or unbiased reviews, pardon me, check out YouTube because they got a lot of a lot of different videos on there, people using the product, which is kind of cool because uh, it definitely works. It definitely seems to work. They've been mentioned in like, oh, geez, a lot of different uh, publications on cannabis. Um, I was actually on Twitter earlier looking around, and I think High Times even mentioned them, which was kind of cool. So, you know what? These guys are definitely on the market. They know what they're doing. They're not just, they're not new. They're not just sitting there like, oh, we're going to try to do this. They're like, we're here. This is what we're doing. We are enhancing the plant growth, developing better potency, better flavor by using these products, right? Use this stuff, you just get the better yield, which is pretty cool. So I'm definitely going to have to talk to my brother-in-law and see if maybe, maybe he wants to try this stuff. Because I know he's definitely, I think he's starting a new new uh, batch of plants this year sometime. Or maybe he's already started. I don't think it's too late. I don't think it's ever too late to add into it. I don't think it would be. You know, definitely let it, uh, let it grow. Let it grow. No, 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 no. All right. We're not going to sing Frozen. I, I could, but I'm not going to. <laughs> but yeah, so they don't have a huge product line. They've got a few different products, but it's obviously things work. They stand behind their product. The reviews I'm reading are all good. They're all just freaking rock solid talking about this stuff, about how good it is. So you know what? Check these guys out. That's all I'm going to say is check them out. If you're growing and you want to grow better, check them out. You can buy directly from them or on Amazon or pretty much anywhere. Which is cool. And of course, if you just want to buy something for somebody else or whatever, you know, check it out. They got other stuff on there too. Got their own uh, rolling papers. Hell, that's cool. I'm always looking for rolling papers. I like the hat actually. TMB Naturals hat. Not just the black hat with the logo, but you know what? It looks slick as fuck. I'd love a hat. I would love a hat. <sighs> yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. We're contact us. And of course, they also have a 1-800 number. So if you just want to call them, you can call them. you got questions, I'm going to throw it out there. 1-888-543-8988. Check it out. Give them a call if you want. Find out a little bit more. Get those questions answered. Try the product. Just check it out. Okay? You know what? I'm going to take another dab just because it's it's dab time. Because it is. It's dab time. Oh, we got to heat this bitch up. Super crazy, though. Mm-hmm. Oh, that turpy cough is sitting back there. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Now, you might be wondering why I'm just in such a good mood. Yes, I'm dabbing. Of course, that's going to put me in a good mood. But my wife bought cheese strings. <coughs> Excuse me. I love Yamuza cheese strings. They make me happy. <laughs> they really do. So, good stuff. Good stuff. It's a good snack. 
Who doesn't like cheese? I'm a huge cheese whore, I swear to God. Whenever I puff, I usually want to have something with cheese afterwards. But, you know, eh, sometimes. Don't you just hate it when sometimes you have a sesh, you get the mega, mega munchies, and then you just overdo it, and you eat just fucking everything in sight. Every now and then, I've gone that way. <sighs> yeah. Now, if you have that super awesome metabolism where you can just eat everything and shit it out within 5 minutes or 10 minutes, 20 minutes, whatever minutes, however long, and just don't gain weight, good for you. However, the majority of us stoners, I think, do put on some pounds if we get too heavy into those munchies too often. I remember when I was with Bean, we had a sesh once, and uh, yeah, he ended up having like three meals afterwards, and he was like, oh my god, I'm so hungry. The next day, he's like, fuck, I'm so full. I'm like, yeah, because you ate three meals, brother, and you still haven't taken a shit. So, that wasn't good for him, but... It's crazy. However, I find with this Coma Kush Shatter from our friends at Budzilla.ca, um, you know, I don't get super munchies from it, which is cool. I get a little hungry, so I usually get prepared for that. I'll have a little something, something. Um, my go-to, my munchies, my craving list is usually something salty and crunchy. Every now and then, I, cr- I you know, I'd love to just have... Um, some red licorice. I love red licorice. However, I can't have it anymore because it's, you know, sugar. Dino Sours, another good fucking choice. Again, can't have those. But I've never been too big on, uh, you know, the sweets. Except for those things, which, you know, every now and then, that was my go-to. Nowadays, I get a licorice, you know, like once a year. (laughs) It's not very often. But... I think my number one, number, number one go-to, I think I need a new chair here, the puff cast chair, the puff chair, that's what we're going to call this, we're going to call this the puff chair, it's, uh, the clips aren't working very well, I think it's, I don't know if it's loose or what, but it just seems to want to fall apart here, so I'm a little scared, I'm scared to lean back, so we're just going to take a puff and hope I don't fall backwards. Do 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 play play a song. Do 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 do. Ha cha 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 cha. Oh. <coughs> this is <coughs> because I puff. I puff because I want to. Because it helps my mental health. It helps my well-being. helps my everything. makes life just a little bit more enjoyable. I'd say a lot more enjoyable. It just takes that edge off. Uh, if that's why you puff, you know what? Great. I'm glad you found cannabis. It took me so long to find it. I was so against it. But uh, I'm glad I finally came around. Because you know what? There's no going back. Cannabis is the way. Cannabis will definitely just help, right? Don't be afraid to try it. If you're listening to this, you've never smoked a day in your life. You just like to listen. Maybe you're scared to smoke. Maybe you just can't smoke. I don't know. If you if you have the means to smoke and you want to try it, then just, I'm just going to say this. Know your source. Know your source. Get something that will work for you. Don't just go buy some ditch weed and smoke that, because that could really taint your first impression. Then you'll be like, oh, it's just shit. I don't want to smoke. You know what? If you can get hooked up with a dispensary, even better, because then you can go in there and you can tell them what you want specifically it to do for you. If you want something that's just going to be more pain relief, there's tons of stuff out there. If you want something great for anxiety, depression, bipolar, right? Again, there's specific strains that are really good at these things. Um, White Widow is a really good one that I recommend, especially if you have a um, high tolerance and it doesn't really, uh, like flour doesn't really do much for you. That's my wife. Flour doesn't do much for her. White Widow um, doesn't take her much and she feels good. She feels relaxed and she can lift that haze, lift that fog and just kind of slow life down and just do what she needs to do with it, right? Whereas most strains do that for me, right? Some strains I find I get a little bit more amped up, but most of them are pretty good. All right, looking at the clock here, and I am out of time. No! That was a quick 30 minutes, guys. Hope you enjoyed this episode of Because I Puff. 
And again, check out tnbnaturals.com because they got really cool products to really help your growth for your, your cannabis plants. So check them out, give them a shot, and uh, share their uh, website and their products with other people if you know that they're looking to grow. Okay? All right, guys, I'll catch you on the next one. Probably going to be uh, sometime this weekend, either Saturday or Sunday. I don't know. Check out the, the Twitter account for updates uh, because I puff at the Nightly Toker. Or just the Puffcast. Either way, we post it on both. All right, guys. Stay lifted and keep smiling. Peace.